This is a Lance 1985 travel trailer. Now, we're going to start on the outside here. And this has some interesting features. I've never looked at travel trailers, but look at this. Up front here, in a storage area, we have this beautiful wall to slide out. Cargo truck. And this is so great because you can take heavy things and put them right there, but that's not all. We also have this, which looks like a shelf, but it's actually a table. You can use it either way. You can put it here, use it as a shelf, put things on it, or you can load things in here. And look at that. It conveniently slides out of the way into this nice bay. I like that. That is nice. Every RV out there should have that feature. That is cool, I have to say. This one here, this, this is where your batteries are, locked behind this. I don't think this is, oh, it actually is open. It has a little tray that pulls out so you can secure your batteries. There are outlets here, so that's handy. So if you're out here doing something, you can plug in. We also have, on this side, some more outlets. Right there, 110. And this, that's where your TV is, your coax, things like that. And I believe your water heater. You have a cool bumper where you can store your stinky slinky. And look at this ladder. I can actually get up this ladder. This awning apparently has no arms down here, so nothing for you to walk into. And it is automatic. It'll come in, has a wind sensor. Awesome. I like that. John, let's go to the front of oh, this yeah. and let's talk about some of the things up here. All right. Now, this thing has this power jack. Nice. A storage area for your your tow cable, your power. What's good about that? Because it keeps it out of the dirt. And you have a dedicated place to put it. Same with your tow hooks. There are hooks back here for storing those. Nice. And then you have your propane locked yep. up in here. That's where that goes. John, you're forgetting something. What about this very nice large window? This is over the bed. So you can lie there and you can look up. And guess what? It also opens so you can get some fresh air in there. Nothing like fresh air when Nothing you're out like camping. All right. More battery storage. Look at that. Another storage area. This is for your generator. Yes. And you have a lug wrench in here as well for your tires. Slam latch door. And that's about it on this side. Now, John, did you mention and tell them that this is actually a four-season travel trailer? It can go at, into the cold as well as the heat. It has excellent insulation. So you Something should be else is that it's built in California? Yes, it's built uh, in California. Where they have more stringent rules? Right, they can't use toxic chemicals in the process, so that's no right. toxic glues or any other items that will, could potentially make you sick. Yep. Let's go. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. Everyone can see we just walked to the front door. This is the perspective you get. All right, John. Hey, check out this couch. A beautiful couch. But, well, that was easy. And guess what? Now it's time for bed. That is nice. Hey, John, you want to go look at the stars? Oh, sure. Up here, and I can lie down there and look. I can see the sky. That is, right I like that. Head. And then if you want privacy, John, what can you do if you still want to see the stars and you want to have some privacy? From the bottom of the window, there's a shade. Well, you leave it a little open if you want to see the stars, John. Oh, look at that. I can still see the stars, but no one can see me. It's like magic. Now it's morning. That was a quick night. Look at that. Yeah, that was a quick night. And we have this lovely deep sink here in the kitchen. Look at this. Look at like that sink. Nice fixtures. Tiny shelf. And look at that. Nice deep cabinets. Very deep. Keep all kinds of things in there. Yes. And I love the trays. I do now like that. Us, there's one thing about those trays, John, I think that's very nice too. What's that? They come all the way out 
And so you can use them in other ways, right? Yes, you can. What I, you know how sometimes we get stuck, like I know it's restoring stuff and sometimes stuff is wet, you don't want wet stuff in wood, which is true. But you know how it used is? Sometimes when we are camping and we do not have water, yeah, and I have to wash dishes, right? Um, I wouldn't mind having that to take yeah. the dishes with me to wherever it is the campsite that we're going to wash. That's them. right. They do have camp washing stations mm -hmm. sometimes. We have a propane stove, reburner, oven in this model. Look at that. It's a big oven, actually. You wanted to keep me out of the oven, didn't you, John? I did. Stay away from that. Check that out. Nice microwave. All your controls are right here. The level indicators. Everything's right there next to the stove. And now we have the refrigerator. Oh, John, one thing you didn't mention about that cabinet. I just what? Want, can you open it up again? Yeah. I don't know if folks notice that it's lit inside. Yes. I really love when manufacturers do that. There's also an outlet up there in the cabinet, and then there's also an outlet down here. Right. Back to the refrigerator. This air conditioning is cranking. I don't need to put is. my head inside of this one. No, you don't. Okay. All right, let's take a look at the bathroom, John. Well, into the shower with me. It's a little bit short. I'm 5'7", like I said. So... It is a little short, a little small, but it is a small travel trailer, so 19 footer. So this is good for the size. Nice sink. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Little medicine cabinet. And lots of storage over by the toilet here. Look at that. That's your wardrobe, actually. I like the fact that it passes through here. Yes, it does. And three drawers. And then we go to this side. We have your entertainment system with a radio and a small shelf here with outlets so you can bring peripherals. I, I like the fact that they have this in case you want, like, you know, the kids all like to play video games. Right, and you have some place to put them. Yeah. And a little storage if you want to store anything else to go with this or anything you want. We have drawers here. Very deep. I think the salesman mentioned that these are on 150 pound guides. This also turns into the bed. The table comes down like most RVs. How comfy is that chair if you sit in the, the booth if you sit it's in the It's actually not bad. It's pretty nice. Okay. Hmm. I like this. It looks like you could fit quite a number of adults. This is a big this. Booth. It is. It's bigger than most U shapes I've seen. This is very large. And I like the light fixtures too. Yeah, these are pretty. Mm -hmm. And it has windows all the way around. Do you have a pet peeve for this uh, unit? A pet peeve? Well, it is a travel trailer. John, it's a very <laughs> nice travel trailer. It is a beautiful travel trailer. John, actually. wait, you forgot something. What I forget? What kind of a tour guide are you? A terrible one, apparently. Well, Look up. Oh, there's a skylight. Bet you didn't see know about that one. I oh my didn't. gosh, this is really nice. That is really cool. And it you can close it off. Oh, so you get this one. Oh, you can open it up. That's pretty cool. See, now even your non-paying customers can stargaze. They can't, well, sort of. You can line the floor. They get light. <laughs> <laughs> but, All right, um, pet peeve. So far, I haven't seen anything. I mean, the only thing that concerns me is if you have to assemble the couch. I mean, you do have these fancy little armrests that you have to slide into their holders. But, I mean, that's it's simple. That's pretty simple. You know, you just fold the couch up like you saw me do, and you just slide that in just like that. It's a little stiff. It is a little firm, but you know what? It doesn't matter because the bed is soft. <laughs> All right. So then it's my turn for my favorite time for my favorite feature my favorite feature so for those of you who watch our channel i'm really enjoying being out in nature i love this stargazing window if you want to point to me john i love the fact that it opens up to get a nice breeze and i also love the fact that i can just lie there and look up at the stars that that is by far oh 
and this skylight. My favorite feature by far in this unit. So how about build quality? This seems to be very well put together. I mean, I haven't seen anything to indicate that it's not. I mean, we even finished the back of the, uh, the cabinetry. It's nice. A lot mm -hmm. of people don't do that. Yeah, I think at this price point, and there's one other thing that we missed, John, and that is this extension oh, on the, the counter. Oh, extension for the counter, yeah. But at this price point... This is nice. This this is probably... Okay. I found one little thing. Oh, a thread. I found a thread. <laughs> I found two threads. But for this price point... This is nice. This is very well put together. I have... I see very, very small things that you would find in any piece of furniture that you might buy, but nothing that really stands out, and it's very firm. It is. It's solid. It's very, this is very solid. It's well built. So, I don't know, John. I'm going to give this a 9.5. I would, too. This is well built. So then, I guess we both agree that the fit and finish on this unit is a 9.5? Yes. Very, very nice. All righty then, folks. There you have it. I mean, I like this. Yes. All right. Well, it's on to the next one. Thank you for watching. Oh, put down in the comments below what you think of this unit. It's a travel trailer. We would really love to... <laughs> you guys are probably very familiar with that look I have by now when I... When John does that, but... You guys... <laughs> Put down in the comments below what you think about this particular unit. Okay. It will help us to spread it. The YouTube algorithm loves it when people put comments in there. And we want to be able to share our videos with as wide of an audience as possible. So uh, go ahead and let us know what you think. Okay, now we're on to the next one. Yeah.